So I'm going to show you how to draw up the magic triangle for density. So density will go in the bottom left hand corner of your magic triangle. The mass will go at the top of the triangle and the volume will go in the bottom right of the triangle. So say if you wanted to calculate the density of a shape, you'd cover up the density and it'd be mass divided by volume. So if you needed to calculate the mass, you need to cover up the mass in the triangle. Since these are side by side, you'd do density multiplied by volume. So if you needed to work out the volume of a shape, then you do mass divided by density. So these are the three formulas which you can use relating density, mass and volume. So let's have a look at a quick example. So we've got to work out the density of this solid box if the mass of the box is 300 grams. So we have a box which is 9 centimetres by 4 centimetres by 8 centimetres. So the first thing we need to do then is work out the volume of the box because we need this if we're going to find the density. So to work out the volume of a cuboid it's really easy to do, you just need to multiply the three side lengths together. So you do 9 times 4 times 8. You can do this in any order. As always, I'll give you the same answer. So if you just type this on your calculator, so we've got 9 times, f 9 times 4 times 8, that's 288 centimetres cubed. So if you look at your magic triangle, if you need density, this is mass divided by volume. So the mass is given in the question, which is 300 grams. So you just need to do 300 divided by the volume of the box, which is 288. Again, just put that on your calculator. So 300 divided by 288 so that gives you 1.04 grams per centimetre cubed